This video will show you how to use ARC to compute a 95% confidence interval for proportion. In this example, we had a sample of 400. 120 of them were overweight. So we want to find a 95% confidence interval for estimating the percentage of overweight students in the population. If you wish to get the confidence interval estimate using the formula that is explained in most of the standard textbook, then you can use this BingConf function in the HMISC package. Now, if you don't have the HMISC package, you should install it first. To do that, in the R console, you click Package and click Install Package, and it asks you to find a site to download. Just check one, and then look for HMISC. and click OK to install it. And to use this HMISC function, you will first have to load it. You click Package, Load Package, and look for HMISC over here, and click OK. The function will be loaded. Then you use this BingCom function, so I type in the R console, just type BingCom, and then open bracket, now we have 120 out of the 400, so 120 first, 400 next. The option for using the formula that is explained in most of the textbook is this asymptotic. So type in asymptotic using double quote as open and close quotes and then close parenthesis and click enter. You get the confidence interval. First, you get a point estimate. So 120 out of 400 is proportion is 0.3. Then you have a lower bound and upper bound of the confidence interval. Now, if you're asked to find the marginal error, the marginal error will be half the size of this interval, or the difference between the point estimate and lower bound, or point estimate and the upper bound. So, for instance, if you want to calculate the marginal error, point uh, the difference between point estimate and upper bound will be like a 0.344 minus 0.3, that would be about 0.044984. Okay. This confidence interval is a 95% confidence interval. If you wish to use other confidence level, you have to set up the alpha parameter to something else. So alpha, when alpha is 0.05, it is 95%. So if you want to have a 90% confidence interval, you have to type in alpha equal to 0.1. So for instance, if I want to do that, I can actually use the up arrow key to bring up the previous executed function. And over here, type in alpha equal to 0.1. So I specify parameter alpha equal to 0.1. That will give me 90% confidence interval. So I then click enter. This will be 95% confidence interval.